Am I the asshole? For inviting my brother's wife and their kids but not his girlfriend and their daughter on family vacations? I'm usually the person in the family who plans family vacations. My brother is still married to his wife but she kicked him out after he got his girlfriend pregnant. I love my sister-in-law and she'll always be family to me no matter what happens between her and my brother so I've always invited her and her children to her family vacations, and I plan to continue doing so. My parents also invite her to all of our other family events and have made it clear to my brother his girlfriend isn't welcome. My brother has never said anything about it but his girlfriend is angry that her and her daughter have been continuously excluded for the last three years. Her entire argument is that her daughter is getting old enough to understand that her siblings are favored over her and it isn't fair so I have to stop excluding them, especially since she isn't going anywhere and her daughter is our family too. Our next vacation is planned for February and she's demanding I invite them but I've said no because I don't want to make my sister-in-law uncomfortable since it seems like she's finally stopped wanting a divorce and being angry with my brother. Am I the asshole? Not the asshole. I personally would invite only the wife and kids and tell your brother to GTFO. Not the asshole. Thumbs up. My partner just cheated and I wish my brother-in-law was as awesome as you. Info. Sil stopped wanting a they getting back together? Info does your brother want to reconcile with your sister-in-law and is he still with his girlfriend? Not the asshole I wouldn't want to hang out with the mistress either. Not the asshole. Invite whomever you want. If your brother does not come, his decision. For clarity your brother's mistress is upset because she and her daughters are not included to events of the family whose marriage she broke up. Smiley face, smiley face. Why not the asshole? Not the asshole. It's an unfortunate situation but I don't think you owe anything to his girlfriend's daughter considering the circumstance. In a perfect work, no, the child shouldn't be excluded. But that's just not how it is. Your brother and his girlfriend both need to accept the consequences of their actions. It sucks that it affects their daughter, but that's life. Maybe his mistress, knowing X is no longer looking for a divorce, fears her boyfriend will leave and go back to his wife kind of a handwriting in the wall feeling. This could make her push to be included and push hard to have her child recognized in a material way. Not the asshole. Why would you make your sill uncomfortable just to appease a woman who chose to fuck a married man? Dollars to donuts she wants to go to cause more trouble between your brother and Sil. Info um, what? If I was the brother, and I wanted to keep the girlfriend, I wouldn't go anywhere near any family events the soon-to-be ex-wife was attending or invited to. Not the asshole. As a relationship has already been established. The girlfriend should forget about your family and concentrate on other events that don't include any of your family. He certainly complicated the family dynamics, it seems. Not the asshole she chose how she entered this family. She got with a married man, held his hand as he blew up his life, and now wants acceptance. Sorry no. If she'd like your niece included then she and her father are welcome, but AP is not. Why should her kid come before his others and make them uncomfortable by bringing his mistress on the trip? Hell no. She can plan a family vacation with a man she simply cannot let go of, but he no longer comes packaged with a supportive family to support her. Bummer. Not the asshole I'd give the opposite answer if your brother had divorced, and remarried the GF. But your brother has so far not chosen to do so. If you talk to the GF again about this I'd tell her you can't invite both your brother's wife and GF, so wife wins. If it were a choice between wife and ex-wife, wife would win. Not the asshole. You're doing the planning here. Not to excuse your brother's cheating behavior but she shouldn't have slept with a married man. Let the girlfriend plan her own vacation. Not the asshole maybe skip the invite to the brother too. Then he won't be able to somehow forcefully bring the GF, but I always assume things like this will happen, he might have more decency than that I'd the guy but considering he cheated, makes me suspicious. You have to love the pluck some APs have when they demand to be accommodated before the family they wrecked. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. She doesn't get to break up a family with the help of your brother and demand things. No. She can sit her ass back down and wallow in her own choices. Not the asshole. Who the fuck does she think she is? Her lover boy is still married to your sill so what's her point of being there? And why does she fight to be around people who don't like her? What a weird situation. You're the asshole your brother cheated his girlfriend did not. Did she even know your brother was married when they first started sleeping together? Then you just exclude your niece for the sins of your brother. Your family kinda sucks. Uda. It's been three years. 
I feel like it's time to grow up and quit punishing your niece because your brother cheated on his wife. This is just a longer version of the joke. I love my girlfriend, but my wife hates her guts. Not the asshole. Not the asshole let your cheating asshole brother and mistress be mad. What did they expect? I would keep doing what you are doing. Not the asshole. Yeah bring the woman and the daughter that destroyed the world of your sill and nieces. They'll sure love it, s. Is the girlfriend for real? The audacity. I wish you'd leave your brother out too, I don't know if you include him because he is dad to nieces but he is defo the biggest eye in this story. Wait so our brother and sill still married? Not the asshole GF should have thought about this when she was sleeping around. I feel bad for the child but it is what it is. She and her mom are not and never will be accepted because of how she came to be. Not her fault but sins of the parents. Not the asshole. Your brother and his affair partner are seeing the consequences of their actions. It is very sad their innocent child will have to suffer too but that's something they should have considered when they decided to have an affair and keep the baby. They have no one to be mad at but themselves. Please keep including and supporting your sill, I feel awful for her. Not the asshole. Question though. What if your brother wanted to bring just his daughter? Wouldn't change my judgment if your family says no to that as well but it isn't the kid's fault. No way would I take them on vacation until the child is old enough to come alone. A day is one thing, spending a week or more with your cheating spouse and his GF is another, but, your sill is going to have to accept the facts, this child is not going anywhere and she's going to have to interact a little bit with her at family events. After reading about all this dysfunction, I think everybody except the kids are the assholes. ESH. That kid is starting to get that old and IDGAF what y'all's problem is excluding effing children is trashy. You're the asshole the child hasn't done anything wrong in this situation so excluding her is wrong. It seems like his girlfriend isn't going anywhere either. Slight you're the asshole you won't invite the mistress but you're inviting the brother, thoughtful face, does he even take care of his other kid? BC a deadbeat is just as bad as a cheater. The other daughter is still your niece and part of the family. NTA for not inviting the mistress. Edit PS tell your sill to have some sense and move on with her life. This man is still with his girlfriend like get a grip. You're the asshole. I'll probably be getting down voted for this, but it seems that the mistress is the only one facing the backlash from this family after the husband. You know, the one who made the vows to be loyal to sill stepped out on her. It's not at all fair to the child who was innocent in this, especially since Sil decided to forgive him and stay with him despite the child, so he has no real consequences from this, but the child has to continue to be punished? These children are going to grow up and see the way these adults handled this and it's not going to be pretty. Not, not the asshole. If my brother cheated on his wife and knocked up his girlfriend, I would definitely still be inviting his wife and their sons, not his mistress and their child. And I don't even particularly like my Sil. Not the asshole. His mistress has lost her damn mind. Yinta. I do not agree with Redditors here. Your sill is family. The GF knew what she was doing when she got pregnant with a married man as did he. There are consequences in life. She needs to put up and shut up. Tell her if she wants a family trip she can plan one herself and invite your brother's family to attend. If any of you choose to go is up to you. You are under no obligation to invite her or the child to yours. Not the asshole. Actions have consequences they don't need to be on your family vacations they can go on their own. Why are they still married and not getting divorced? That seems weird. Especially since she isn't going anywhere. At least not with you, lol. Not the asshole. The home wrecking mistress doesn't get to pretend to be family. Not the asshole but it kind of sucks that neither you nor your parents seem to care in the least about your brother's other child e your niece granddaughter. She's too young to understand now that's the GF trying to use her to get on the holiday but at some point she will understand none of her dad's family want anything to do with her through no fault of her own. Not the asshole. I'm not sure I fully understand the relationships here, but I tend to agree with the response saying your brother is probably the one who should really be uninvited. If your bro is still dating this girlfriend and there is no intention of getting back together with his wife, then you'll probably need to include her in some things at some point. But if she's an ex-GF that happens to have a kid with your brother, the easiest solution is to invite your niece-nephew and don't invite the GF. Wait, he still wants to be married? What? Not the asshole. Not the asshole although your brother sure as I would stop inviting him since he created the situation and isn't doing anything to help it. 
the mistress doesn't get to throw stones in her glass house. Syl isn't proving to be much smarter since she is considering taking your brother back when he still has GF and shows no signs of changing. I will say the youngest niece has had the hard path picked for her because of her parents' behavior try not to hold it against her and include her where you can. Not the asshole. Just leave the brother and girlfriend home. Or the brother can come without the girlfriend but with the kid. Kinda asshole because your niece can't control the circumstances of how she was created and born but the mistress has some nerves. Not the asshole but you should invite the child and not the mother then also have open dialogue in a setting just you and mom about integrating the child in. What kind of family dynamic is this? Girlfriend and wife? Are they in some kind of poly arrangement? Or is girlfriend just another word for mistress? Why would someone's mistress think they're invited to family gatherings? Why would her kids be siblings with his other kids? Editing because I forgot another oddity. She doesn't want a divorce? Huh? Please, up. So much more context is needed. Why can't the other child come without the GF and the father can take care of his child while on vacation? Why do both need to be excluded? Not the asshole. It doesn't seem that the youngest affair child has been integrated into the family with her half-siblings so there is nothing that child should feel slighted by. I didn't get the impression that the children in the marriage live with the affair child, nor do I get the impression that they have a sibling relationship with her. So the affair child should be none the wiser about all this. The established familial relationship with Syl and the pain it would inflict on her by being around this affair child is unreasonable to expect. And possibly why the GF is pushing for it at a typo.